This is the greatest thing ever invented. Say hello to my Reese's peanut butter cup. Uh, oh, holy peanut butter cup. Mm. You must worship the peanut butter cup. You must bow down to the peanut butter cup. You must kiss the peanut butter cup. You must bite the peanut butter cup because it's delicious. It is delicious with its gooey peanut butter covered in chocolate. Who wants one? Leave comments downstairs in the basement. Mmm, delicious. Mmm, mmm. Oh, it's so good. Oh, need more. Short video. I've come to realize that you guys really like the short videos. At least you guys comment a lot more. I like the comments. I miss the comments, guys. Leave comments downstairs in the basement. If you're on Facebook, leave comments downstairs in the in that bar down there. I know that it's kind of hard to leave comments on in the basement when you're watching on Facebook. But if you're on Facebook, leave it in the box down below. So the basement slash box. I don't know. Anyways, leave comments downstairs. Um, as I enjoyed my Reese's Peanut Butter Cups. Mm, do you guys like Reese's Peanut Butter Cups? Um, if you do, high five. If not, hey, it's cool, whatever. But, question for you guys, I want to know, I think I've asked this before, but 614 videos, you tend to ask the same questions over I think because I run out of questions I mean that's a lot of questions anyway this question if I've already asked you I'm sorry but I forgot um, if you eat candy bars what kind of candy bar do you guys like anyways um, real quick I'm gonna talk about something you guys know I do the weird news um, and I'm we were making videos well actually we made one it was kind of like a test run of weird news uh, my lips are chapped too, side note. We're, we're working on a new format actually. Um, I can say this, there might be a new channel with weird news on it. I, I can't fully discuss it yet. But I do want to tell you this one story before I let you go. Um, one story, okay. You may, if you're following the blog, thank you. And you probably already read this, but I'm going to tell you guys. You may have already heard it. Here we go. Okay, so this girl right here pleaded no content to involuntary manslaughter. Uh, she decided that her child, that is two months old, was a little cold. So instead of like any regular human being, um, wrapping the kid up in blankets, I don't know, maybe resting the kid on your body to keep it warm, decided to put it in a bassinet in the bathroom. Okay, okay, that's a good idea. It's a good idea. Uh, maybe it's maybe it's a little warmer in there, you know. Um, this is the part where she fails, and that is that she, twenty-year-old, put in the bassinet, turned on the hair dryer, and laid it next to the bassinet. Now the bassinet that um, had a hood on it basically acted like a oven, and the twenty-year-old went into the other room with the father of the child and they sat down and they watched a movie which then they fell asleep when they fell asleep um, the baby at some point probably was crying because the blow dryer was left on and the blow dryer was blowing heat onto the child that was inside this basically like a car almost and the temperatures rose to about 108 degrees. Um, the child did not survive, um, passed away, and she pleaded no content. Okay, if you guys want to read more of the story, it's downstairs in the basement. But uh, her, 
Really? Your thoughts on this story? 